Hey everyone, I have an injury update and actually a pretty fun day ahead of me that I wanted you all to come with me on. I know that I haven't been the greatest at vlogging my uh, events and things like that. So I did want to take you with me on this like healing journey because um, I feel like I feel like you would all benefit from seeing how I'm doing and you know, maybe learning from my mistakes and learning from hopefully some successes that are gonna come from this. So I wanna take you all with me and I just wanted to say thank you all for always the support that you all show me on this. So thank you. So I didn't see my physio for all of last week just because of scheduling. So I'm seeing him today. I'm feeling like from a kicking standpoint, I'm not doing too bad, but from like other motions, I'm kind of having trouble with them right now. So I'm a little bit concerned with where my injury is at. So I'm hoping that today will provide some clarity for me and also just, you know, give me a better update on like where I'm at. And I'm distracted because a car is really loud outside. So if you hear that, I got distracted as well. But after physio, I am gonna do whatever the physio says. If I need to rest, ice, whatever the case may be. And then later today, I'm going axe throwing. This will be my second time ever going axe throwing. If you've gone axe throwing, let me know and tell me some of your like tips and tricks because the first time I went, it actually wasn't too bad, but I went with someone who's like low key professional, high key professional. So he kind of showed me the ropes and uh, humbled me heavy. So I'm excited to see how I'm gonna do today and if I remember what he showed me last time cause it's been, I don't even know the last time I went. Maybe it was like, maybe it was last year. I'm not sure, I don't remember. I think it was last year. But hopefully I remember the form that he taught me because it was working. Um, but I'm like a little bit nervous because I like being good at things. Um, all you perfectionists out there must, like, I, I'm sure you know, if you know, you know. So doing new things is kind of scary for me, but we're going into it second time through the first time. I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed it so much that I wanted to be on a league, even though I was like, not the greatest. I was like, I should join a team. Like, it's so funny how things happen like that, but I'm excited for today. Um, like I said, I hope Physio goes well and I'll keep you all updated with everything that's going on. And I think I might have him also check out my shoulder because it's still not doing when I need it to. So I know that I need to be doing more exercises for it. So I know that's on me as well. Okay, so we're at the Physio office getting ready for my second physio appointment, not apartment. <laughs> and I noticed, can I show you? Yeah. So when I go to kick, like if I go to chamber, this, like this height hurts, but then when I go up, it's like fine-ish. It just doesn't hurt as much, which much. is interesting. So I'm, I'm not lower as flex. When you're up here, yeah. there's load on the muscle. But when you go up, you're also moving your body. So this moment is mm. taking the weight off the muscle. And it's actually the body taking the weight. Mm -hmm. That's why it's not as painful. Okay. Okay, so that's why the pain is less at that point. Okay, so I just noticed that, but the using it to Using it to kick still is not great. No. And I noticed that stances have started hurting too now. Okay. So like okay. if I go too deep or too hard into a stance, it just like shouldn't I think do that it. gap of last week, it kind of bit us in the back. Yeah. So yeah, because my dad had me demonstrate some moves, just stances, because I was like, okay, I should be fine just doing stances because I haven't had an issue with them. But I don't know. Yeah, it yeah. just, uh, yeah. <laughs> it, it hurt after like three moves. Yeah. I don't know why I'm even trying it, but I'm gonna try it anyway. Is it just to gauge flexibility? Just to gauge little flexibility. Any pain there? Uh, I'm just sore today. Yeah, but little pain. My joint this time. Yeah. In the hip? Yeah. Little sore? More in the head. 
Did the tipping help? Yes. No pain? No pain. Good, good. And when you take stances, that's when it hurt? Yeah, like deep stances have started hurting. Yeah. Let's avoid those for now. Let's build some strength into it first. Okay. And push it up. No. And let's start from here and push it I up. I already feel it. Go over here. Without even. Okay. Yeah. Best physio ever. Right? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Make it pink tape. Makes it all better. All right, here. Okay. Okay, okay. We can sit up. Shall we tape the shoulder? Yes. Please. Yes. I'm gonna tape it slightly differently, so okay. okay. So that it stays in the socket. It doesn't come out of the socket. Perfect. <laughs> Thank you for letting me be a diva with the pink tape. Oh, you're welcome. Power pose. With that look. Yeah. It has, it has to come with that look. The seafood face. The seafood face. And you can relax. Oh, I love that. That like feels oh, good. good. Yeah. It's actually yeah. like forcing my shoulder into the right spot. Into the socket, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Wow, that's wild. It was like immediate, like once I released, it was like still, yeah. So I just got back from physio. As you can tell, I got my shoulder taped up. I got my butt kind of taped up. I don't know if you can see it or not, but I'm all taped up now. Um, hopefully it'll last like until I see him next. But now I'm off to film some content for some short form content, probably some reels. Um, so let's go do that. This area is getting super busy now that the sun's out. It's finally nice out here. Been waiting forever. Feels like forever at least for like the nice weather. But now it's like crazy busy. Like look at the parking lot. That's insane. So many people. This area has a lot of like fields and like diamonds and stuff. This is like literally a sports complex. But uh, my little getaway spot's super busy right now, so I'm gonna have to film in front of a lot of people. Literally, I only did one take and it was the quickest filming and it's already posted actually on Instagram. Probably a good thing because I may have done something that my physio would have told me not to do, or actually he did tell me not to do literally like a half hour ago. Go home, I'm gonna ice and chill out, but um, yeah, no one tell him. <laughs> so on our way to walking home, I got distracted and realized that I really wanted a arugula salad from Lovetto. So that's where we are right now, waiting on a salad and a pizza. And then maybe we'll go home after this and get ready for whatever's next in the day. I got my arugula salad. I don't know what's in it or else I would make it myself. But we're here at home because honestly, I just like eating in the comfort of my own home and not feel like I have to sit in a restaurant in like a semi uncomfortable chair most of the time. So I just kind of like chill out, watch a show. And I usually, honestly, I usually pick up my food and take it back to my house to eat it. Unless it's like way better, like hot, like fresh out of the oven or stove or whatever, then I'll like sit down and eat it there. But otherwise I'll probably take it home and eat. This isn't like too crazy of a salad. Like it's not crazy special, but the dressing, I have to wash my hands. The dressing is just like, like chef's kiss. Also, you might be like, Sylvana, you weren't wearing that like two seconds ago in the last clip. Um, this is my third outfit change of the day. That's just the kind of person I am. That's all I got for you. That's the only explanation. Extra dressing, because it's that good. It has a lot more than I always think it has. Whenever I see the container, I'm like, that's it. Cause I'm so used to like humongous salads, but it gives me a reality check. A reminder that this is definitely enough salad.
Is that ASMR? <laughs> okay, dressing number one. And then we'll stir it and then and then I am gonna use the full other dressing as well. Mix, 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 mix. If you're around my area or have a Levetto by you, try the arugula salad and let me know your thoughts on it. Or if I'm just like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just obsessed with it, like the dressing. Oh, ASMR. That's funny. Wow, I don't know. This dressing just gets me. That I find myself craving it, which is insane. Right. Mix and then eat and watch a show. And I'm also the kind of person that like rewatches shows. Um, so I'm in the middle of rewatching Mom. If you've watched Mom, if you know, you know. It's like, it's so good. And honestly, I get like selection anxiety or something. Cause it's like, I know that the show is good. So I'd rather just like rewatch a good show than start a new one and be like disappointed. I know that's weird. Cause then like, that's how you find new shows that you enjoy. So I do, but I have to be in like a certain mood for me to feel like courageous enough. <laughs> if that's a thing, I have to feel courageous enough to start a new show. So today is not one of those days. We're gonna rewatch mom again while I eat my salad. Outfit change number 971 of the day. We are ready for ax throwing. I just gotta answer an email from a student and then I'm good to go. We have arrived to the axe throwing place. Bad axe. Wish me luck. Okay, I'm gonna do a warm up. I'm nervous. Just don't get in my way. <laughs> and I retire, okay? So leaving now, super loud in here, but leaving now, I got my butt absolutely whooped today. I was so bad, it was so bad. If anyone does this more than just recreationally, let me know what tips you have because your girl was not competitive today. Why does it smell good out here? So now I'm off to a birthday party. So I unfortunately won't be filming there um, just because it's a small gathering with some of my friends and um, students and everything, but we're going there. It's a surprise party. Um, yeah, I'm super excited and we're pretty much just heading there now. But thank you for joining me today. I had a pretty interesting day with Physio, random restaurant trips, uh, content creation, axe throwing, and a birthday party. Um, yeah, that's pretty much a out of the ordinary day because most of my days are teaching. So let's not run over by a car. But thank you all for joining me today. We had fun, I hope you enjoyed it. But before we go, I wanna do my Kicks Fam shout out of the week. Thank you so much, Jose, for being a part of my Kicks Fam on my YouTube community. I appreciate you more than you know. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye everyone. Well, I saw him stretching in class and I was like, he's so good and he wants to improve on everything. But why not his flexibility? Flexibility. You know? Why isn't that being prioritized as well when that will directly help his performance? Yeah, you know, I'm talking to yeah. You know what you're saying. Yeah, <laughs> you know. <laughs>